The cutlass has got to be done in a week, because that's when I scheduled the big reveal party at the bar and grill. All right, let's move her in. Maybe. Uh, I removed all the traction in here. Oh, and you know what they say, you don't get a second chance to make a good first impression. Yeah, it's nothing special so far, but let me tell you, intricate lowrider paint jobs are about as calm around here as the unicorn farting rainbows. I mean, they're cool, but they are different. While hot rods have clean, sleek lines, lowriders want to be right in your face. You know, lots of colors, crazy patterns, etc. Each car is totally one of a kind. Although I'm extremely fascinated by lowrider paint jobs, I have never attempted or done one before, ever. Um, so I'm very nervous that Richard just wants me to figure this out in a very short amount of time and with no practice. And it's gonna be shiny! To get the kind of depth you want on a lowrider paint job, it requires a ton of layers. And I mean a ton of layers. Let's go again. Well, the reason why we're doing that is it's all finished. You'll be able to look into the paint job, and you'll think you can grab something down into it, like being in clear water, but it'll just be nice and smooth like a baby's bottom. Keep going, baby. Just keep going. 